Good evening. Good evening. So before I begin, I would like to throw upon a question on all of you. What does this theme mean to you? Just cleanliness. What does it mean to you? We'll start. Just a simple words like maintaining cleanliness. What does it mean to you? No waste. Sorry? No waste. Yes, sir. Yes, okay. Okay, taking the effort. Okay. And what Dispose areas like where? Dispose of wastage. Okay. Does it also mean the cleanliness of mind? Yes. 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 Okay. So spiritually as well as physically. So before I talk about much about cleanliness, I would like to uh, present this skit which I had performed uh, in a group at an NGO which I recently joined. The name is Youth for Seva. And uh, we have been uh, given a situation to present uh, uh, how we live in a society where uh, people throw garbage. And uh, this is a very small scale that we have presented. So there are two friends who are walking on the road. Hey, with a packet of chips. Hey, we'd like to taste the chips. Hmm, it's tasty. So what's up? Hey, look at this pile of garbage. So dirty. Tell me about it. That's how every street of Bangalore now seems to me. Oh, I'm planning to move out of India. Yeah, even I think so. So where do I throw this packet of chips? I don't know. Oh, why are you asking me that? Can you come to look at the pile of garbage? Let's just throw it there. So, we also had another skit which showed that there was a family, uh, so a kid, and uh, he was asked, he was getting sick because of uh, the uh, disease that, that was being spread by the garbage on the road. And they were being very hypocritic because they themselves were throwing a few packets of chips or ice cream sticks. And this shows how hypocritic our society is and now people are realizing that we are the problem and we are the solution. As said by Gandhi that the uncleanliness of mind is more dangerous than that of the body. If the mind itself is not clean and conscious, how can he help to keep the surroundings clean? So this theme got me reading about Swachh Bharat Abhiyan and uh, uh, I came to know that 55% of the Indians don't have access to public toilets, to toilets. And uh, so the main focus of this, uh, of this initiative is to build toilets. Have you heard about uh, the ugly Indian? Yes. 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 So it's an anonymous, so I didn't know till now that uh, it's an anonymous group of Bangaloreans who register and they themselves go out on the streets and clean. And they don't, uh, they don't really they consider a project when it's, it's carried off for more than 90 days. So they seriously concentrate on a project and only finish when it's done. So yes, things are changing, people are improving and we are also becoming more aware that we are the problem and we are the solution. This also brings to light other issues in the world. The war, the crimes, the hatred is also being caused by the inappropriate mentality in us. And that is again a deeper root in us, a deeper issue in our society. So cleanliness is not just making our surroundings clean, but making ourselves clean. The cleanliness of mind, soul, body and heart. And that's when it becomes important that cleanliness is of utmost importance in one's life. We need to have the clarity of thoughts to lead people. Just like Rossi Smedley, he had the clarity of thoughts and he led the people with the proper action and helped people in the journey of public speaking. Today, Toastmasters is about 15,000 clubs strong in over 130 countries with over 3 lakh members. Isn't that huge? Yes! So that's when cleanliness is really important and it's not only uh, cleanliness in your surroundings but also in your inner, uh, maintaining your inner peace like how Cherry and uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. 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 So before I, uh, so in Toastmasters, typical Toastmasters meeting, we have three sessions. The first session is prepared speech, where the prepared speakers come on stage, give their prepared speeches. Uh, following the guidelines given by the Toastmasters International. They have two separate evaluators. Then we have the table topics round, which is the most interesting one. The table topics is first. Sorry. The table topics round is at the first, and where uh, the speakers are given impromptu topics, and we are supposed to speak for one or two minutes. 
and in the end we have the evaluation round where the general evaluator evaluates the whole meeting and the, the different speech evaluators evaluate their own um, prepared speeches. The general evaluator of the day is someone who is the territory manager of Quicker. It gives me pride to say that he is my mentee. Please let me welcome, he's made it big, and uh, please let me welcome the school charismatic and confident Karnagar Day.